I love Sharpie markers, but there's one flaw with the original fine point. The fine point is by far the most common and most beloved version around the globe. I truly love the fine point, but what is the flaw? The flaw is the ink color is on this side, the cap side. And since I never store my markers cap side up, I would run into problems when I put them into a bucket. The cap color would disappear. Storing them in a glass jar isn't the solution either because you can't see the markers in the middle or the back. What did I do? Answer, the same thing I do every night. Try to take over the world. <laughs> no, just kidding. I tried to buy a product that solves my problems. Bad news. Every product on the market had at least one flaw and I found and cataloged every point of frustration. This started me on a mission to eliminate every pain point and create the best marker holder in the entire world. And I'm not even kidding. Truly the best in the world. And I did it. Here it is. <laughs> this is the ultimate over-engineered Sharpie marker holder, and I couldn't be more thrilled that this exists. Before I continue, please know I invested over 100 hours of development to bring this to you. If you're digging it, please like and subscribe because that lets me know more content like this is desired. So what are the problems? What specifically makes this the best Sharpie marker holder in the entire world? Buckle up. I'm about to tell you. Capside down is best. Why? Because you use it capside down when you're drawing, and there should be no orientation change when returning it to the holder. Flipping it around or tilting it requires more effort. Ain't nobody got time for that. You can easily see the cap colors. These three layers are clear, and the bottom is a mirror. This blue marker in the back stops here, but the mirror extends the cap color all the way to the bottom for maximum color visibility. Easily drop them in with no resistance. Foam blocks require some force, often requiring you to hold the block with your other hand. Also, there should be enough space around the markers so you can grab the one you want without disturbing others. Storing them loose is way too chaotic. Markers should land straight up and down. It's just neat and orderly that way. Nobody likes a sloppy mess. It should spin. That way you can bring the markers that are in the back easily to the front. The clips align. Watch how it rotates the clip and puts it neat and orderly. I spent a lot of time figuring that out and I just like it. Horizontal storage. Some say this is the best way to store markers. Well, now you have it. What do you think? Is it the best Sharpie marker holder in the world? If you agree with me, type agree in the comments. Otherwise, let me know if you think I went a little too far with this. <laughs> Be honest, I can take it. I do have some materials, enough to make nine of these. If you want one of nine of these that I'm going to make for sale, follow the link in the description. It will not be a low dollar amount. Unfortunately, this takes hours and hours and hours to create. I'll do it if you want it. I'll sign and number it as well. If you want to see me make this, follow the link in the pinned comment or right here and drop me a big old like. Thanks for hanging with me on this. Stay awesome, internet.